Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1, Fathead Candy Roth out on vacay. A couple more days. Uh, she will be back on Monday. Plenty going on in the world. Uh, just reading about uh, some of the colleges now uh, closing down. Notre Dame had an outbreak of coronavirus, so they decided to go uh, all virtual. And a lot of that going through the uh, colleges who had tried to be open and uh, have decided to uh, shut down. Uh, I know for my uh, niece, who attends Ithaca, uh, she had the same thing. They decided to go all virtual. So that seems to be the trend, um, and it will be interesting to see how uh, regular K-12 through school goes uh, here on Long Island when we get going and things get started. Uh, obviously, the uh, outbreak of coronavirus these days is a little different uh, up here than it is uh, at some other schools and down south, and especially colleges where where, uh, you know, there's a lot of parties going on and stuff. So hopefully we don't have that issue with uh, school. Speaking of which, uh, a lot of parents, you know, obviously this is the time to do back to school shopping. Well, a couple of stats on your back to school shopping. Uh, as you can imagine, the hot new item, sanitizer and masks. Uh, if you go into any store, uh, you'll see a lot of uh, kids back to school masks. Uh, one in five parents started shopping earlier this year, partly because they had uh, more time to do it, but partly because they want to make sure uh, they get everything before stores run out. Uh, fewer parents taking their kids shopping for back-to-school stuff, a lot of them doing it online or curbside uh, pickup. Three in ten teachers, 30% of you, are updating your tech to deal with virtual learning. You learned a lot, I guess, from March to June, what works, what doesn't work. A uh, big thing with teachers, new computers, routers, uh, keyboards, headphones, dry erase boards to hold up during Zoom calls. And uh, a lot of parents, including us, spending less this year uh, because you're not running out to buy brand new backpacks and clothes and shoes and stuff for the lockers and things like that. You're just uh, getting the essentials, although some parents are buying cool decorations for kids' bedrooms, uh, so it can make their Zoom background look good on the virtual learning. I listen. You gotta look right when you get out there uh, for the uh, school year. If you're gonna be online or in person, uh, you want to look the part, right? Get the kids going. Uh, we are here on Long Island. I, I would assume most districts are the same. Uh, three weeks from yesterday, and I like to announce every. Uh, Every night in the house, you know, I want to make the kids aware that this, you know, staying up till one in the morning thing uh, isn't going to work for much longer. So uh, yesterday before I laid down at 930 at night, uh, I said, kids, 20 days away, 20 days to go. Get ready because you're going to be going to bed early, getting up early and school is back in session. So uh, hopefully it's about as normal uh, as can possibly be. Uh, we will get to a special song at 7.30 for you. Oh, by the way, I better do this now in case I forget later. I will try to do this later as well. Happy birthday to one of my sisters. Uh, now, my this is interesting, right? You think my parents plan a little bit? My birthday is July 30th. My uh, oldest sister, uh, August 10th, who we uh, celebrated about a week and a half ago, and then the middle child in my family, um, Dina, celebrates a birthday today, August 19th. So we were born, obviously, different years, but we were born within 21 days of each other. That is some planning. Well done, and it's a big birthday for her. Um, I will tell you that the number ends with a zero. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what the first number is. I guess I'm not supposed to do that, right? Uh, but the number, the second number is a zero. So uh, congratulations uh, to her and happy birthday. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. On My Country, 96.1.